YouTube channel. So as you can tell by the title of this video, we're going to be reapplying this gorgeous, gorgeous wig. Like, look at this, y'all. This hair is everything. Everything. <laughs> so if you are interested to see how I reapply this beautiful handmade by me wig custom unit, everything, then just keep on watching. Okay, so what I'm starting with is washing my hairline. I'm using Garnier Fructi Sleek and Shine Shampoo and Conditioner. So I'm really just taking that and working it in, getting all of the residue off my hair, like any glue left over from whatever the alcohol didn't get up, and just cleaning off that section so that I can reapply my wig and it will look seamless. Okay, so now that I've rinsed off the shampoo, I'm going to be taking the conditioner. And honestly, y'all, this is obviously a very lazy way to do this. You could just re redo your entire hair and like wash your hair, but I did not have time for all that. So I just wanted to wash um, my hairline, condition it just to make sure that it's taken care of and it doesn't suffer, which it has not, thankfully. So just, you know, take care of your hair, do whichever method works best for you. This is what I wanted to do and worked best for me in this time. So this is what you guys are getting. <laughs> Now I'm applying a hair oil. This is olive oil. You want to make sure that you're taking care of your natural hair underneath your installs. You do not want to have dry, unmoisturized, like dead, brittle hair. Just do as much as you can to protect your hair from the harsh elements that is, you know, the whole process of putting a wig on. So. So now it's time to reapply our wig. As you guys can see, I did add an elastic band to it this time just because, you know, the first time of me applying it using the bold hold, that was just more so a trial run just to see how it works, how I like it. And, you know, practically every day I use an elastic band so that way I can take the wig on and off because I'm not about sleeping in a wig all the time and having it on all the time. So I just really like how it looks and obviously the elastic band is working very well and I'm very happy about it. So it's really just up to you if you want to use an elastic band or do the gluing method every time you reapply it. It's up to you but I will reapply it using the glue soon. If you guys want to see that leave a like to this video to let me know. Also, as a bit of extra security, I do um, use bobby pins to secure the wig in place because, yes, the wig won't move with the elastic band on it, but it, in the back, it's still kind of just like free flowing. So just to get that to be as secure as possible, I do use bobby pins in this method I've been using for a while. It definitely works. Your wig will not shift or move or be just yanked off or fly away. <laughs> 
So this is definitely an easier method to applying glue. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Yeah.